Okay, so today we are going to be flying from um, Lansdowne House in Canada to La Grande Riverie um, in Canada. So yeah, uh, we have full fuel and right now I'm going to do the checklist. Okay, light is good, trim is good, flap size set, mixture is rich, brakes are good, CTAF. Um, prepared to take off runway okay I'm gonna take away the yoke take that off and we're off for some reason the rudder isn't working Okay, so the rudder is not working. So it's a very crazy takeoff. We're not going to talk about that. Okay, now the rudder pedals work. Okay, that was a little crazy. So we're going to get to a higher altitude, around 3,000 before setting the autopilot. It's raining here in Canada. It's around 325 over there, so yeah. Okay, just making it a little higher. And we're going to set the autopilot vertical wait, okay, so the altitude is going to be 5,000, the vertical speed as 300. Then we're going to set the navigation, direct departure to La Grande Rivere. Enter and yep, now it's working. Okay. So somehow I got a little low with the mic. I'm going to reduce the mixture just a little bit because it's flashing red over there. Okay. Okay, and we are heading into fog. So we're already above, I think, the highest point in it. So yeah. And if we go outside. It's very rainy and cloudy. But I do think it'll clear up soon. Let me go back inside and look in the VFR map. So it's around 300 miles to our destination, which is all the way over there. This is where we're landing. Okay. It's like 5,000 feet the runway, I think. So that's good. Okay. So far, so good. 
so I'm going to stop the video right here and check on it in a few hours. Okay, I'm just doing a quick uh, check-in. We're around the middle of the flight. We have around 75% fuel. Um, yeah, um, we left the clouds a long time ago and we're 5,000 feet at 116 knots. Um, it's some hilly sections over here with some uh, trees. So yeah, it's around 350. So yeah, there's some rivers over there. Okay, and yeah, I am going to end the video right here and check in when we're about to land. Okay, um, there's around seven, uh, around eight minutes till landing. We are just 15 miles, 16.2 miles to be exact. Um, miles away from our destination we are 117 miles per hour uh knots per hour i think and 5,000 feet high we're going to go ahead decrease um the speed airspeed and make the altitude down to 2,000 vertical speed is going to go way lower vertical speed minus 500 and now we're at minus 1,000. I'm going to quickly check the elevation of the airport. So it is 640 feet high. Okay. So I'm going to make the vertical speed a little higher. You don't want to be falling a little too fast. And there's currently six minutes till landing. We have around 50% fuel, and it's around, I think, six real time. And the forests have given way to kind of fields, like grassland a bit. Okay. So it's a bit cloudy, and the sun is right behind us. I'm going to go outside. And... Yeah. The sun is, I think, hiding behind a cloud. Maybe over there. I think the airport's going to be somewhere around there. On the other side. I don't know. Going back inside. Um, we're heading toward a forest region right now. Okay. So far, so good. So, yeah. I'm gonna try to take away the yoke so that we can see what's under it. Yeah, those are the flaps. So yeah, ETE of 4 minutes and we're at 8.8 .8 miles to our destination. And if we look outside, we can see the forests and some lakes. I 
I think it's a bit snowy in this region. But that may just be a different type of dirt. There's a river over there. And this is forest. Want to decrease the rate of descent. Actually, no, we have to increase it to get there in time. Okay, and the wind just blasted the door. So I do think this is snow. It's getting a little foggy. Right behind us. We are getting a little low. But that's no problem. I can always break away the autopilot. And my mic keeps from touching the yoke. Some rivers. Well, at least I think they're rivers. I think this is high enough. And turning the vertical speed higher. We're 1 minute and 50 seconds to go 4 miles away. We look on the VFR map. GPS tracking. Alright, so far, so good. And now I see the runway, so I'm going to break off the autopilot and start turning. Okay. So I do think this is the runway. I'm not sure if it's paved or anything. It might be just a dirt runway. First flaps. I'm gonna go down to 20, no, to 2200. Second flap. And now to 1800. Third flap. And then, fourth flop. Actually, I think that was all the flops. Yeah, it's completely down. And line up for the runway. Align myself. I think we're a little too low, but no, that's good. Eighty knots. So far, so good. I hope the batteries work. And power off. Doing this flare, and yeah. Okay, I think that was a good landing. Okay, so we landed in La Grande River Riviere. Um, yeah. In Canada, this is the fifth video in the world tour, and thank you for watching.